Fusion 360 has many different ways you can quickly get to a 3D model. Under the Make pull-down, you can get quotes and send your parts to multiple suppliers who can provide your part for you. If you have access to a 3D printer, you can use the 3D Print tool. Selecting your model, it will tell you how many triangles it will calculate based on the refinement level selected. You can change the refinement level to high, medium, or low, or use custom settings that will include things like surface deviation and other elements. Expanding the refinement options area will show you what some of the options are for customizing this output. When you're ready, you can choose how to output this data. In my case, I'm going to be using Autodesk Print Studio. Print Studio has a large database of standard printers, and I can drop my model directly into the center of the printer that's selected. Taking a closer look, I can review it and see if it's got the face that I want down. If not, I can make modifications, such as rotating my model, to apply it to different faces, so that the more refined face is up. I can also tell, have it check for errors. It found some non-manifold vertices, and I can tell it to try and repair that. This might be happening due to screw faces not quite properly aligning with countersunk holes. With the geometry repaired, I can start to look a little more closely at how this will be printed. One of the things I really enjoy about Print Studio is the ability to generate supports. When you're working with thinner bodies like this one, supports are very important. It's a lot of surface area that needs to be printed in the end in open space. Finally, let's go ahead and preview what our print would look like. It will take a minute or so to generate the tool pass for our 3D print. With the tool pass generated, we can see, slice by slice, what this print would look like. We also get estimated volume of the material that would be used, as well as an estimated time based on the printer that we have selected. This is a great way to understand just what it would take to get that physical prototype produced for you to have your design review.